Tell us about what's going to be happening today. I have no idea. I suppose I'll just um, try and suck it in the guts as much as I can. <laughs> So today we're at CCP, WA, Concert Court Productions, um, thanks to CCP, Tim Bradsmith, but we're here doing a the photo shoot, so um, for the up and coming tour and also the promotional material for everything, so here with Brody Butler, you know, one of the main photographers around and Tim Bradsmith as well, one of the main lighting guys, so I'm still looking for a lighting guy and photographer actually. <laughs> This was the easiest part, so I'm quite um, quite relaxed today, and just because Brody knows what he's doing, Tim knows what he's doing, and we've got the warehouse as well here, so and, and best to have these guys part of part of our team. Yeah, we're shooting at uh, CCPWA today, so thankfully uh, Tim uh, does all of Phil's production stuff on stage, so we we're able to get uh, in here today and they set up a beautiful arrangement for us with a bunch of lighting, uh, so that's been really handy, made my job a lot easier. I just love Phil from the moment I met him. We first got together in 2010, um, he had a show at the Octagon. Um, and I understood his spirit and understood what he was trying to achieve. He's very passionate and, you know, he, he likes to um, perform to his utmost every time he gets on that stage. And just as a human, he's just a beautiful person. Yesterday we was down at Fairbridge and I'm um, scouting out Fairbridge to do the next shoot for Storyteller and um, there was horses there so I got to go up to the horses and get over that bit of anxiety and um, surprisingly enough in a few days I go down and I'm doing an induction to learn how to handle horses so we're doing all that to, for this film clip you know. But on the other side it's all about my um, anxiety as well you know so the horses I, I read up a lot about horses actually um, help people with um, mental illnesses and things like that. So I'm really looking forward to it. You know, I um, couldn't sleep too much last night because I was so excited about what we did at Fairbridge yesterday and and just working, even just patting the horses and, and things like that. You know, it was a it was a really good feeling. What what I like about working with Brody is that he's very he's very choosy about where he, where he shoots and what he shoots and. That's something that I love because I've always been the sort of person like, hey, let's try it. If it doesn't work, we don't use it. But with Broder, it's, it's really cool because he, he takes the time out to actually, you know, we was in here um, a few days ago scouting this place out and walking through everything. And over the last few days, you know, we'd talk probably four or five times a day now ever since I started working with him, whether it's for the video, music video, or whether it's for this photo shoot. But it's going over every little detail and and I thought that's quite cool and you know it's, it feels good for me for once for someone else to take control of, of what I want and he sees what I want as well and then takes it to another level. You see that? That's good. That is exactly what I was after. Okay, it's perfect. Yeah. That, that light is, is the background. <laughs> huh? I mean, oh, so you like, you like what I did, but you yeah. like what he did. But I like the you background. Like Brody? You like no, Brody? but I do like the background. <laughs> He's full of shit. <laughs> yeah, I was just saying how much of a nice guy you were. <laughs>